Hey guys, I'm back for another comparison. Last time, if you saw the video, you know that I compared the Arctic Tumbler against the Yeti Tumbler, and the Arctic outperformed Yeti hands down, no doubt. Went 45 plus hours. Now, this time I'm gonna compare the Rec Pro Tumbler to the Yeti Tumbler. Now, this is the same Yeti Tumbler that I've had. I use it all the time. Now, this time, the Rec Pro, it came in the mail a couple weeks ago, and I wanna compare it and see how it holds up to the Yeti. So let's check it out. First of all, I'm going to do an unboxing and show it to you. It's called Recreation Pro or Rec Pro. You can go to recreationpro.com to pick these up for $19.95. And that's with a slider lid. Uh, it says on the outside of the box, keeps your hots hot and cold cold, won't sweat or stick, vacuum sealed, double wall insulation, made food safe, obviously BPA free, open close slider lid with a straw slot. Um, says the same thing on this side wash before use uh, 30 ounce stainless steel tumbler basically like the rest of them i think let's open it up and check it out comes in this neat little bag that i probably wouldn't use just for presentation i guess and rec pro recprousa.com but i know if you want to pick them up for 19.95 go to recreationpro.com and the outside of this paper, the sleeve here says pretty much the same as the outside of the box. Made food safe, BPA free, yeah. Let's get rid of that. It looks about like a, a Yeti. It's not stamped anywhere. Okay, it has the Rec Pro logo right here. If you can see that. It's on the bottom. So it's not imprinted anywhere else on the, on the tumbler. And it does have the slider lid, which actually is awesome. I know most tumblers are, they come with the regular lid. And it looks pretty much like the Yeti. Let's check it out. This is the Yeti, same one. And it has some bangs and scratches on it where I've used it. And they look the same. Feel like they're about the same weight. This slider lid works. Yep, works on the Yeti. And the Yeti lid works on the Rec Pro. And in comparison, other than the opening and closing of this lid, they look about the same. This lid has a white seal and this the yeti has a black seal okay so i'm not going to weigh them i'm not going to measure them or anything like that in comparison this is the yeti this is the rec pro uh, they look to be exactly the same height and they feel about the same weight i know one big issue that my wife had with the arctic was that the base is a little bit bigger and it wouldn't fit in the cup holder in her minivan. This one does. So, and this one is exactly the same size. It's not bigger. This one's the same size as the Yeti. It looks just like the Yeti without the, the uh, stamp there. Now, it's time to check them out. Let's do a comparison and see which one holds the longest. Okay, for comparison purposes, we're gonna use 30 pieces of ice in each tumbler. Okay, there's 30 pieces in the Rec Pro Tumbler, now the Yeti. Okay, there's 30 pieces in each. And they look like they'll hold the same amount, same size cups. The Yeti. And the Rec Pro. Okay, if you can see right here, 70 degrees. 
Okay guys, there you go. 30 pieces of ice in each tumbler. The only difference between the two tumblers would be the slider lid on the Rec Pro. I'm leaving that lid open for comparison purposes. It is 70 degrees in here. It's 6 p.m. and I'll keep checking this thing periodically and we'll let you know which one holds ice the longest. Good morning guys. It's now 6.15 a.m. on the 16th. Just over 12 hours since starting the comparison. Let's check them out and see how it's going so far. All right, as you can see, the Yeti on the right and Rec Pro on the left. And the Yeti's holding up pretty good. And the Rec Pro looks like they're pretty equal right now. Just a big chunk of ice right in the middle. Okay, it looks pretty good so far. We'll check it out again in about 12 hours. All right, I'm back to check in real quick. It's now 6 p.m. on the 16th. It has been 24 hours since the start of the comparison. Let's check in and see how it's going. Okay, you see the Yeti on the right and the Rec Pro on the left. And the Rec Pro, it's kind of hard to tell because of the slider there, but looks like it has a good chunk of ice in there, some water. That's 24 hours there. And the Yeti, actually looks like a lot more water in the Yeti. I believe the Rec Pro is outperforming so far. Again, that's 24 hours. All right, well, at 24 hours, it looks like the Rec Pro is doing a little bit better, but they're still pretty close. It's kind of hard to tell. We'll check it out later on and see how it's going. All right, checking in again. It's now 12.15 a.m., just a little after midnight. It's the 17th of May now, and these things have been holding ice now for a little over 30 hours. Let's check and see how well they're doing. All right, the Yeti on the right. You can see that. Still ice in it, not a lot, but still has ice, mostly water. And then the Rec Pro, uh, I actually believe the Rec Pro has about twice as much as the Yeti. All right, they've both held out for 30 hours. It looks like the Rec Pro is outperforming the Yeti. We'll let it keep going and we'll come back and check it a little later. It's now 33 and a half hours. It's 3.30 a.m. on the 17th. Let's check them, see how it's going. Okay, let's check the tumblers, the Yetis on the right. And there's a couple of small pieces, which is great at 33 and a half hours. And the Rec Pro. Still got a big chunk of ice for 33 and a half hours. All right, guys, I'm gonna say that yet he's pretty much done at 33 and a half hours. We're gonna let this thing continue on and just see how long that Rec Pro will go. Down to the last little bit with the Rec Pro, it's now 44 hours after starting this comparison. It's 2 p.m. on the 17th. Let's check it out and see what it looks like. All right, lids are off. So you can see the ice, the lids are behind the cups there. The Yeti, again with just water. And the Rec Pro with just a little ice, if you can see that. A couple small pieces. That's about all I'm gonna get out of that Rec Pro. 44 hours is the limit. 44 hours is what I've got out of the Rec Pro. All right, guys, there you go. That's the end of that comparison. 44 hours on the Rec Pro, 33 hours on the Yeti. I'm not knocking that. The Yeti did great. Who needs ice in a tumbler for 33 hours? You just don't. But it's fun to check it out and compare and see which one holds ice the longest. Now, the Rec Pro, 44 hours, that's outstanding. And considering the price, it's basically the same type cup. It comes with a slider lid for $19.95. So that's an awesome deal. Go to recreationpro.com to check them out. They also warranty all of their products and they also have a lot of other stuff online, RV accessories, boating accessories, golf cart accessories. So go to recreationpro.com and check them out. $19.95 with a slider lid for the 30 ounce tumbler, $17.95 for the 20 ounce tumbler also comes with a slider lid. Thanks so much for watching. Y'all check out my other videos on the channel. Have a great day.